Hello and welcome to Get in Touch with Your Creativity. Um, this is a set of online tutorials which is brought to you by the Carers Collective Hackney. My name is Catherine McAdam. I'm going to be running the tutorials with you. Um, I'm a former carer and I've been delivering coaching and workshops at the Carers Centre in Hackney for a number of years now. Some of you indeed may have actually met me. This short introduction just gives you a little bit of background information about the tutorials so you know a little bit about uh, what they're about, what to expect, how long they might take and also anything that you might need to have to hand. We designed these tutorials for um, a group of carers who were going to be embarking on a creative program and we decided it would be really helpful to give people an opportunity to just think about what creativity is and to explore in more general terms how being creative can help improve some aspect of your life as a carer. So in the tutorials we're going to explore different ways of getting in touch with positive and creative thoughts, feelings and ideas as a way of taking a break from daily routines and doing something a bit different. The tutorials are designed to be done either by yourself individually or they could also be done with somebody else. Either is fine. However, if you are doing it with somebody else, you'll both need a copy of the materials to work with or some paper. So there are four tutorials for you to do and each of them takes roughly about 10 to 15 minutes to complete. However, you can take as much or as little time as you need or you can spare. It's completely flexible. So you can complete each tutorial or each exercise separately and do them at different times. But you do need to complete them in, in the right order. So starting with tutorial one and finishing with number four. Um, if you prefer, you could also complete all the tutorials in one sitting. And if you do that, you probably need to allow about 45 minutes to an hour. If, as you're going along, you need to take a break, either to go and attend to something or perhaps um, because you need a bit longer to complete one of the exercises, just pause the video and then when you're ready to start again, press play and off you go. Before you start, there's a few things you need to have to hand. First thing, you need a pen or pencil to write things down. So we will be giving you some exercises to do and you'll want to write your, your answers down. Um, also, if you can lay your hands on them, if you have some either colored pens or pencils or even some paints, that would be really helpful for one of the later exercises. But don't worry if you don't have these to hand. If you have access to a printer, then you can download the worksheets and print them off and write your answers straight onto the worksheets for, for the exercises as we go through. However, if you don't have a printer, then don't worry. Um, you'll just need some paper or a notebook that you can write on. And as we go through the presentation, you can view the worksheets on the screen and just write your answers on the paper or in the notebook as you go along. So finally, you just really need to be sitting comfortably at a table and have some uninterrupted time. By the end of the tutorials, we hope that you'll have had a really good opportunity to think about creativity. What is it? What is it for you? How does it express itself in your life? What can you do? How can you use your creativity? And along the way that you will have identified some aspects of yourself that you really recognise as representing your creativity. You'll also have had a chance to think about and express other aspects of yourself that you know about which go to make the whole person that is you. So not just your creativity, not just you as a carer, but all those other things which go to make up um, you as a whole person. If you find you're having some doubts or worries about how you'll go about um, doing more creative stuff or just spending more time being creative, then we'll also have a chance to begin to make a plan and hopefully help you deal with some of those concerns. 
And finally, we hope that you'll have started to use your creativity more regularly, that you'll be finding things that you can do, things that you can access um, yourself directly. However, you can also sign up for some of the other Carers Collective Hackney programmes if you want some inspiration. So that's it for the introduction. You're now ready to start tutorial one.